It's an honor, and uh, it is actually a great, great honor and pleasure to receive this uh, uh, recognition. This is the first recognition ever received for <laughs> swastika issue. Uh, so I really appreciate it to the uh, United States uh, Hindu Alliance, and uh, particularly uh, so Gokuji, uh, was a very wonderful, uh, you know, very good team. Uh, bringing all this awareness together and then uh, you know I started actually my own project I just briefly talk about why I started because I, everything else they, they cover <laughs> I think Jeff is a good, good recipe I don't have to talk about salt and pepper I mean not the pepper I mean salt and sugar anymore but uh, also um, um, but it, it is actually the interesting experience for me first of all uh, this happened simply because I attended an interface gathering but for host by Interface Center of New York about uh, hate crime. And then the, one of the you know, experts of the speakers, about 100 people, 100 interface leaders are here. And then at that time, he, the, the, one of the speakers said, swastika is the universal symbol of evil. And basically, I asked the question, what, what, what do you mean by universal civil evil? You know, here we have Buddhists, we have Jains, and you know, the Hindu, of course, and uh, Native Americans, too. So why do you call it that's a universal symbol of evil? And then this particular speaker didn't know anything about it. <laughs> and so, <laughs> you know, because, you know, I asked, do you know the Buddhist use also, you know, Hindu use, and nothing. He doesn't know anything about it. I mean, in a way, it's a, it was a good reason <laughs> that uh, without that particular thing, if he answered, you know, uh, in the West, this is the, the swastika, but then, you know, whatever the bad meaning, but then in the East is different, then I don't have to, or we don't have to gather even anything. And now, because of that, yeah, I, after his talk, Hindu, Buddhist, and Jains, and uh, Native American, we just gathered at that time. Yeah, we should do something about it. Because, <laughs> you know, I'm one of the person, I came 1985 to the United States. And uh, so, first thing I encountered a swastika in this country, so called Hagen Kreuz, of course, is the when we have a special ceremony for the Buddha's birthday. And uh, I normally create the Buddha's flower, you know, uh, a little bit like you know, flower petals, everything. And then we make the swastika with a, uh, like a chrysanthemum at the very end of the top of the things. And then the Japanese American members, Kate Rust, came to say, oh, you, know, you shouldn't do it, you can't do this here. <laughs> you know, they were, they were really so afraid or something. And so, and then, then, then I realized this is the United States, so uh, maybe I shouldn't use those symbols. So in one way, I'm one of the <laughs> leaders who asked them not to use it. <laughs> so, you know, last 25 years, I mean, before, before I started. So 1985 to, you know, uh, year 2010. So I'm also one of the person who is telling the other, you know, Buddhist leaders uh, in this country, you know, swastika has been treated, you know, not, not a good symbol, so we shouldn't use it. But but so but then, you know, my hope was after 25 years later, you know, people are intelligent enough to understand, so we can we don't have to say anymore, but then now I really have to say because it's a universal symbol evil is totally different, opposite, right? So that's why I was I decided to do this project for when I went to the New York Theoretical Seminary. So Doctor Ministry program and uh, so I just proposed how about this things <laughs> To be honest with you, I, I don't know anything about the swastika much. I mean, I know, of course, as a Buddhist, we use, you know, in Japan, <laughs> swastika all over the place, in a, on the map, especially. So, meaning Buddhist temple. <laughs> so, that's everybody knows, you know, the common sense. But I didn't know here, the swastika equal hitra. <laughs> and, but then, the, so, we wanted to make, a, you know, <laughs> differentiate all those things. So, so, that's where I started. And so, and that was the year 2010. And uh, so now you thought, oh no, yeah, 13 years ago. <laughs>